Good morning. It's Thursday, and this is the Code Arabic, and we're going to be doing some more Life is Strange 2. Um, again, series that I just loved. Uh, the original was just fantastic, and I really, really enjoyed the game. So um, I know it's kind of a strange game for people to be playing, an episodic game that uh, is all story-based, but they're fun for me. I really enjoy them, and I love how the story progresses. So uh, it's it's something that just kind of... I don't know, it makes me feel like I'm in a book and I'm part of the story, which is great. Um, so it's uh, it's just one of my little fun things I love playing. So I hope you enjoy what I've been showing you. Um, the story is really kind of taken off. First chapter is done. I, uh, I think it's saved at the very end, so we should be fine. We may have to play something over but uh, we should be going into chapter two now where we as the main story characters have discovered the little brother's power and now we're trying to help him develop it and it's it's a quick progression on us because there's five chapters and we're only in chapter two and we're like developing his power so um, I'm curious to see where this goes because there could be an infinite po number of possibilities on what could happen to us. So um, I'm going to get right into it. I hope you all enjoy. Please, if you're new, follow. Um, let me know uh, what you think. Let me know what kind of games you might enjoy. Um, you can always chat, you know, even after stream because there's a chat box on the page. So let me get right into it. Um, boop, 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 boop. I believe I've just been using that one. No save file of awesome adventures. Captain Spirit has been detected. Game experience is enhanced by playing Captain Spirit before episode two, and it's free. Oh, wait, so the awesome adventures of Captain Spirit is another game that they may they, they produced um and it's about a kid who is able to bring comic book characters to life if i remember right and i've never played it so i guess if you have played it this game will um if you have a save file would um add stuff to the story and so since i've never played it we're just going to keep going um but it gives me gives me reason to try it Yeah, I hope everyone's having a good Thursday morning. Thank you for joining me. In a wild, wild world. There were two wolf brothers living in their home there with their papa wolf. They all lived happily together, but... But one day, hunters took their dad away. Forever. So now the brothers were alone. And they had to find a new home. They started a journey through the great big forest. The wolf brothers wandered for days and nights, learning how to live on their own for the first time. They slept in the backwoods among creepy creatures and barely ate anything. They eventually found a peaceful orchard and were able to eat in peace. But they didn't know. Hunters tried to tie them up but the Wolf Brothers managed to escape with the help of a friendly bear. He showed them how to oh. survive and helped them find a warm camp for the night. That's when the Big Brother discovered that the little one was not an ordinary wolf, but a super wolf. That's how they found themselves even further, headed to the faraway land of their pop, where they hoped Find peace. Oh. <clears throat> I love that. So, the decisions you make in the game reflect how the story progresses. And so, this little recap gave you, like, your choices. So, like, things that happened in the game were reflected in that. You could tell by these little quick breaks where it decided what your story had done. So that was kind of neat. 
December 1st, Wilmette, Willamette National Forest. Puppers! heavy for you a few days ago. Oh, he's getting stronger now. He... <clears throat> Let's try to lift something else. Not too heavy, though. I'm a little tired. Go. Oh. Hold LT to interact with Daniel's power when it is displayed. You want to do mushroom? Shooting range. Rock. So LT. Okay, so that's how that works. Okay. I'm so glad Daniel took this little girl with us. Hello, darling. You and Starlight. Morning, my app won't play while I'm out as usual, but hi. <laughs> it's okay. So, Sean, what should I try now? Uh, we're not going to do it to Wait the dog. Wait a minute. I'm going to show you something you can try to lift. Not your usual shooting range, right? Yeah, let's let's do the can. How we're not going to do cans? We're not going to do that to can the puppies. Can you fly them all together without dropping any? Sure. Look. <laughs> That's awesome, dude. You're getting way better at this. Okay. Let's show Daniel some more stuff to play with before we call it a day. I really... Mm -hmm. Okay. You could... Try and lift mushroom? Are you kidding? <laughs> I'm <gonna hurt> her. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you're probably right. Let's leave the puppy out of this. We've got a rock. Let's see. We've got a bigger rock. Oh, God, no. That'll probably kill him. Let's see. There's a little rock there. Can you throw, throw this rock in the river? Oh, yeah. Just watch. Okay, that one's a bit big, but the distance is what's really important. So let's try that one. There we go. Nope. How about trying out that rock over there? Just one more time. We already tried yesterday. And the day before. It's too far. I can't reach it. Just one more time. So distance is a limitation on his power. Aww, I'm so close. I can feel it. Oops, something just happened. What? Why do I have a bunch of pine cones? Oh, we are way. We're in the. Where are we? Oregon. Abandoned house. Apparently there's a drawing here that there's drawings I need to do. And we've got tree chain okay, so these are things that we have to collect. We have to look for that tree. Okay, we're gonna go let's check down here. Dude, it's getting nope. late. Okay, can't go that way. So we gotta Let's go get this done way. with this practice session. 
Not going to do the big rock. Not going to do the super big rock, because that just sounds ridiculous. You can barely Dude, lift. It's getting late oh. and cold. Okay. Let's get done with this practice session. I guess I. That's all I can do. Okay. How about that one? You can do it with the small rocks, but not the big ones. You can do this. Trust me. Just relax. Focus. I'll try. He was able to let everything in a room go nuts from his anger. So his emotional state may be tied to it. So when he's feeling like he can't do something, then it's going to make it weaker. Oh, oh, he's moving it. Oh, look at that. Look at that, buddy. Yeah. Whoa. Holy shit. I did it. <laughs> like a boss. You're getting good at you this. You see that mushroom? That was the biggest rock ever. Come on, dude. That's just the start. Let's try something else. Cool. You're like Coach Aaron. You're my power coach. Yeah. A snowball fight? Not yet. This is a new exercise, young apprentice. See if you can stop this in the air. Cool? Okay, but you better not hit me. Like that time you gave me a bruise? Serious. You won't let me, right? Try it. All right, so I'm gonna just over the shoulder a little bit. Use L to adjust your throwing strength. We're just gonna lob it at first, and then I guess trigger. <laughs> John, you saw. Said, don't hit me. <laughs> Sorry, I, I thought you would stop it. Serious. Oh, what if we went after the puppy? What would he do? <laughs> Dude, you almost hit our dog. He Learn stopped it. Aim. I'm sorry, Shroom. But you did stop it, Daniel. He <laughs> learned fast. Let's do it one more time. But there. near me. Yeah, yeah, see? Not super hard. It's just a snowball, Daniel. Okay, come on. We're gonna make this we're gonna make this one count now. Should we should we do it? Should we do uh No, we're not gonna be that cruel. Okay, right in the chest. Uh Think fast! Stop! Whoa! Daniel, that's what you get. Happy? Hell yeah, I am. That was awesome. You did it, man. I did. So you better be nice to me. <coughs> uh oh. Hey, that still sounds nasty. <laughs> You're not getting better. I told you. I'm fine. Just a little beat. Well. You need to rest now. Superhero. Ooh, sounds like we're gonna have to Can find some medicine. Now? Yeah. Let's just fill up the canteens before we head back. That cough has been going on for days, Daniel. I really don't like that. I told you. I'm fine. We've just been outside for a while. Here we go. The Hella Tanker is over the wildfire zone. Get ready for water extraction. Ranger Diaz. Nice work, Daniel. Glad to see our training sessions are paying off. So it Thanks was to you. around Halloween so glad I don't have to touch that water. when it started. It's too fucking cold. Uh, oops. Sorry. I said fucking. Yeah, dude. 
watch it. Seriously. Okay. We still need to have discipline. Um. So it was about Halloween when what? this whole thing what started. Did you find, and now it's December first, so it's been a little about about a month. Okay, I'm home. Oh, and I think it's not working. Was a miracle. But I'm afraid we can't stay here much Gotta longer. Leave these poor bunnies alone. It could be just your internet. Uh, Sean? The family that lived here. What do you think happened? Hey, it's been a while since we last saw that rabbit who lives in there. Yeah. I hope it wasn't eaten by a bear or worse. <laughs> What's worse than a bear in Nano? I don't know. Wolves? <laughs> don't worry. We're the only wolves around. <laughs> family of rabbits lives out here. Just like us. Nah, I'm not gonna prank him. I think it's a bad idea to mess with a kid that's got superpowers. So the older brother reminds me of a friend I had in high school that passed. Uh, oh, I'm sorry. Hungry? Not really. Really? I'm getting hungry. Again? The family who owned that cabin really seemed to enjoy themselves here. Why never come back? Again? You eat like a bear, but you don't gain any weight. That's because I worked it off. Oh! Almost forgot to check our traps today. Oh. We got traps? Nice. No, what in the world? <laughs> we really nailed it with this two-headed snow ogre. Yeah. They're really badass. And Musher isn't even afraid of them anymore. Right, puppy? So we got traps we gotta check. Let's see if we can find the traps. Barbecue. Daniel's see. getting cold. Let's I get know. inside and warm him up. No, we need to check the traps real quick. Are there traps? Where are our traps? We probably should get firewood. Can we not pick up the Too firewood? Bad this wood is rotten. Ah! We had to cut some more to keep the house warm. It'll still burn. Daniel helps me slice wood by holding the logs with his power. Snow monsters. <laughs> it is way too early. I'm still waking up myself. Okay, we need old dog house. So they had a dog here before whoever had this cabin. Daniel's Please. not getting any better. Okay. He needs medicine. A yes. real house. Yes. We, we, with proper we. windows and yes. heating. Keep out wolves inside. Okay. Uh, I don't see any traps around. So... And you just made a cool like design. Okay. Patio chair. I don't, yeah, I don't see any traps. Let's check up here real quick. It's so silent out here. No neighbors, no roads. It's like we're on another planet. Nothing. A new planet. That's exactly what we need. All right. Oh, I guess. I guess we go in. <coughs> oh, he's getting worse. Yeah, I couldn't find any traps, so. I don't know what they're looking. Maybe we'll maybe we'll go to them later. Ooh, cold. Don't worry. We'll make a fire. We're pros now. <coughs> Dude, that cuff doesn't sound too good. Nah, uh, I'm okay. Just cold. You kicked ass today. <laughs> Level up. I did. That was so cool. It's getting easier every day. Oh no, Sean. This is a haunted house. More like, uh-oh, it's time to go over the rules. I told you about showing off. I was just... Whatever. Dude, I know the rules. Let's find out. 
What's the first one? <laughs> Hide your power. If you spin one plate in a diner, what happens? People will freak out. And when people freak, what do they do? They call the cops. Exactly. The second rule is... Don't, uh... Never talk about it. <laughs> wow. <laughs> nice, Daniel. Because that's usually the hardest rule for you. <sighs> Shut up. <laughs> and the final rule? I know. Come on. Um. You can do it. Okay. Um. Avoid danger? Run from danger. This is the most important one. You know why? Uh. I don't know. I mean, with my power, I can help us. I feel if we say no, it's dangerous, he's not going to ever use it. If we say only as a last resort, he may use the power in a situation which would cause the storage to go a different way. Mm. I'm kind of curious. Only as a total last resort. How will I know that? If there's any other way of helping, do that first. Maybe if I had used it before, Dad might still be here. Daniel, it's my fault. I shouldn't have let you alone outside. But... I didn't help. I didn't do anything. Because... you couldn't. <coughs> We've got to find that kid some medicine. <coughs> Don't worry, Mushroom. I'm okay. Oh, <laughs> these peppy dog eyes. She must be hungry. What about you? I'm always hungry. Hey, Bo, how you doing, buddy? <laughs> Let's grub out. I'll make us some dinner. <laughs> yeah. Before she eats us. <laughs> Alright. Can we... Okay, let's make a fire. Pop in and say hello. I'm the only one here today, so work. Oh, good lord. Oh, I hope it's easy for you today, bud. Lighter. We scored with these clothes. Plus five street cred. All right, lighter. We need a light cigarette pack. The space scuba is hovering on dead planet. Let's see. This thing is strong as a rock. Oh, maybe it's in my backpack. No. I still got the freaking condoms. <laughs> it's not in my backpack, so where is it? What sadistic thing do you have in mind? Today? That picture mug. Mushrooms cushion. Comet. Uh, let's see if it's in danger. High school feels so far away now. Yeah, it's cool out so far. Just watering in general, upkeep around the shop. Well, that's good. HQ, I'm flying over the city. No danger in sight. Copy. Where? As long as it's not too busy. I mean, the what? The uh, the wife had a doctor's appointment or something. Yeah, much longer, bud. A couple more months, eh? Reports of base. Can't believe how much Daniel's powers have improved over the last weeks. Medicine. Ooh, we have medicines. Oh, sweet. Giant clothes, container. Broken window. Okay, that's not helping us any. We do have medicine, though. I that's wonder great. how far... No way I can give any of these to Daniel. Ah, oh, crap. Oh, too risky. 
Okay. That's out there. I found the key to this door. I guess using the sliding door is cool. Uh, where's our lighter? Sean stuff. We really lucked out stumbling into this house. Lighter. Sweet. Take. Time to get warm. Wonder where Brody is now. Oh, yeah. No internet. Letter. Yeah. Danielle doesn't need to see this. Oh, that's from the family before. Um, so how's she doing, bud? Like, uh, everything's going well, I hope. Oi, oi, fire. She got, she got the belly now. Here we go. Hold on, Mushroom. We're gonna build a fire. Like everything is going well and it's good. And it's, that's awesome, dude. Have you had uh, any uh, ultrasounds lately? Dang, I am starving. Guess it's time to start cooking. Yum. Too bad I can't make a pizza fly to us. I could start Daniel's delivery service. There we go. Food. Mmm. Tough choice. Eh. This hot dog man issue is kind of weird. Better talk to Daniel after dinner. Hey, what are you cooking? <coughs> oh, I'm sorry. Here's your menu choices. Ravioli? <sighs> so tired of eating the same shit. I just want one slice of pizza. Oh, I'm sorry. Here's your menu choices. Ravioli or ravioli? Okay, okay. Uh, ooh, Dad's picture. That's I'm never a... eating this again. Disgusting. He looks so serious on this picture. I still can't believe he's gone. She had he one a while so back, and everything measured as it should. That's awesome, know, dude. Daniel. I'm so excited for you. It's okay to think about him. Mm. I do it too. Okay. <laughs> dude, you'll be moving cars around in no time if you keep improving like that. Really think so? Well, that'd be a bad idea, but you sure are getting good at this. I wonder if there's anyone else like me. Mm, I think we'd know it by now. Uh, how am I gonna cook the food if I got nothing to cook it in? Mm. Daniel Slayer, inspect. Late. <laughs> Daniel loves his brand new tablet. That marsh burger totally looks like mushroom. Man, I miss listening to music so fucking much. Drawing. Ooh. Hmm. I could do a super cool manga about Daniel. Back out of that. Let's see. How you doing, Mushroom? Poster... No. You're the best puppy in the world. Uh, I need... How am I'm I gonna... I'm just glad this? we found you. Is there... Where's... Okay, I'm confused. Wood stove... Look... Daniel's been sick for more than a week. And it keeps getting worse. How you doing, Mushroom? I... You're don't know how to cook this food. How am I gonna cook this food? I'm just glad we found you. Old phone. Oh. Frame. Uh, container. Medicine. As bad as ah, this there we go. Pan. Daniel needs to eat something after all that psychic crap. Prepare meal. There we go. Just took forever to find a pan. <laughs> I 
I will say this. That one can of ravioli really filled that pan up. I'm kind of impressed. Pant, look, no. I think I could get used to living like this. Quiet, free. Feel like I need to do something. Let's take a look at the family picture that was. Tanya must have been pissed that day. Don't oh. blame him. Next. Dad and Maggie and John. Ah. Uh. A goth falls. Postcard? Kind of curious. Poor guy. I guess kids have to grow up anyway, right? My dad say hello to your little girl in Miami. Yes. There is a sun here and it burns. I love it. Tom knows everybody and I keep waiting to meet Scarface. We're at his friend's killer condo with a beach view and balcony. I feel so spoiled, but I know John's at a castle in the Alps, so I don't feel so bad. Plus, I really like it here. What a great way to start a new century. I miss our vacation at the Secret Lodge, but don't miss the raccoons in my room. <laughs> Hope you come visit soon after the summer. Alright. I need to... Food's gotta be cooking. Is there something I need to do? Just wait for the food? What's going on? Let's see. Let's take a look here. Uh, Look at the newspapers real quick. Of course. He's the town fucking hero now. Oh, Christ. Police are investigating a store invasion by the two Seattle runways believed to be responsible for the death of Seattle Police Officer in October. Hank Stamper, owner of gas station off Highway 5 and a pillar of the community, oh, good Lord, really, confronted the two brothers, Sean and Daniel Diaz, after the alleg they allegedly stole items from his store. Stamper told the police that the brothers attacked him before escaping into the woods. Yeah, I was scared. You know how crazy kids can be these days. What a friggin' jerk. A little racist. Anyway. Dead for a week. Oh, we need that. At least we got some news. I'm used to Hank, so. This will be different. Yeah, let's take a look and see if the. I food. have time to learn now. Do we need to talk to Daniel about something? No, he's just standing there. Oh, Daniel. Alright, serve meal. Sweet. Let's cook okay. Okay. Dinner's ready. Sick of ravioli. That was spaghetti a la dies. <laughs> Didn't you taste the famous truffle sauce? Yep. Plus, I love the garlic bread and ice cream. Yum. <laughs> Ooh, you want some too, huh, mushroom? Uh, let's be nice. Bon appetit, mushroom. Man, she loves this stuff. <coughs> we really gotta get him to a hospital or some medication at least. Sorry. I'm cool. <sighs> Hold on. I need to show you something. Um, okay. Uh... Gotta show him the map. I think I left it with my books. Mm. Nothing here. You said with my books! Daniel! What did you do with the map? Mm. What do you mean? You know what I mean. Where's the map that was with my stuff? Oh, this map. It's in my tent. Sorry, Sean. He said it was in his tent? Puppy! Mushroom. Shroom. I can't get mad at you. 
Stop being so damn... Okay, come on, doggy. Let's go, girl. Hey, man. Can you call your dog? I don't exist. Mushroom, come here, girl. There it is. She was sitting on top of What a great team. Time to play dad, dog. My question is, why is he hiding it? Oh. What the... Mother... Daniel? <laughs> oh. <Got you. laughs> that kid. Shit your pants. Of course I did, man. Anyway. Oh, he didn't get a chance to. Okay. We missed an opportunity because we were getting things on the on the uh, table by accident. What are we doing? Um place map. Okay, there it is. Okay, I think it's time for us to hit the road. You're not getting better. We're almost out of supplies. No, I'm okay. <coughs> it's just a cough. Yeah, a bad cough that won't go away. <sighs> Trust me, Daniel. You need some medicine. Look, here. Beaver Creek? Giggity. What's that? That's where Karen's parents... Our grandparents live. Okay. So what? So we can go there and... They'll probably help us. Why do you always force us to run, Sean? What if they... Don't like me? Mm. I have a bad feeling that there's a, a, a strange relationship with the mom's the mom's parents. So they're family, right? Plus they owe us for what Karen for what mom did. Um you sure? It would be cool to spend Christmas with our grandparents. Man, they're gonna love you. Grandpa's super cool, and I'm sure you guys will be best buds. Well, okay. But Mushroom has to agree, too. She's part of the team. What do you say, girl? <laughs> okay, when? Tomorrow. The sooner the better. I have a, a long road ahead. sneaking mm. suspicion. We should do something fun for our last night here. That's How something. How about a game of dice? If I win, I get to draw on your backpack. You know I'm gonna win and draw a dick on your bag, right? <laughs> I don't think so, loser. Oh. No cheating. Party time. I, I have a sneaky okay. suspicion that something Ready happened to, to the mom because Watch your butt, of his power. Either she left or she got hurt. Alright, so we're going to throw dice. This is an interesting game. They've got, like, it's like a little ship. <laughs> Here we go. Just need a six, a five, and a four. Okay, got a ship. It's better than nothing. Okay, so we got a ship. Uh, we can use either one. I wonder if it changes depending on which one you use. I'm gonna use this one. This ship is mine. I need a five. Just give me a five. Still incomplete. Jeez. Sounds like a no score. <laughs> Got a captain. Ahoy, captain. Ahoy. All right, throw it again. This is my last chance. Don't fail me. 
Yay. No full ship. No score. All right. Your turn. No cheating. Got a ship now. I need a captain. Come you had on. a four there. I just saw it. This game sucks. Don't give up. Phew. It was a close one. My turn now. Be ready to lose. So you gotta fill the three slots on the game first before you can put a, the treasure in the cargo, and that's, I guess, how you get your points. Gotta run, have a good stream. Thank you, Bull. You have a good day. Hope everything comes back well from the wife. Let us know how it goes, okay? Can I get something better this time? Oh! What the hell? Oh, he messed with it. You kidding me? I can see the dice rolling, dude. What did I do? You're just finding excuses. Stop cheating, man. You gotta be better than this. Especially now. Whatever. Can I get something better this time? Oh! There we go. Billboat. I wonder what we would have done if we didn't find these dice. I Add know. loot. I guess Probably you get three throws. Uh, boring. Alright, so add loot. You remember that time I beat Dad at chess? <laughs> you mean we beat Dad? Yeah. And you did help me distract them. <laughs> throw the dice again, because I guess you get three rolls only. I bet he would have liked this game. <sighs> Definitely. Okay, that's a four roll. He was roll. a great pirate. Add that. Just and like us. Captain Diaz, king of One the seas. One more seas. throw. <sighs> awesome. You'll do better next time. Or not. The dice are yours. How long is this gonna take? You think Grandma take? and Grandpa oh, here we will go. have a console? Uh, I don't think so, dude. Sorry. No biggie. Now we're in a conversation. I like playing dice and stuff, too. Whoa. Daniel the big nerd. Getting sick of screens. No way. It's nice for a change. But I still want my playbox. <laughs> yeah. I bet. And I win. Do you know what it means? Yeah, okay. You want it. Here's my bag. Mmm, let's see. Here, what do you think? <laughs> Is that mushroom? Yes. I know I'm not as good as you, but... Nah, it's... It's really cool, dude. Thanks. That was so, cute. let's do another one? And let's do this getting late, because we want to progress this a little it's bit. It's bedtime. <clears throat> Gotta get up early. I'm gonna finish my comic book. She has to pee. Okay, okay. I'll take her out for a walk. You're going to smoke. Gross. You're right. Don't smoke. But it's our last night, so we can do anything. All right, all right. I heard you the first time, dude. What have a bad feeling. Every time something like this, like, there's just that pinnacle point in these stories, and you know something's going to happen. Mm. 
Now, I know that you guys see me smoke my vape on stream. I don't condone smoking. If there's any kids watching, I have been smoking since I was young, and it's still a bad habit. Um, I just don't smoke cigarettes anymore or anything else. So, but yeah, just so you know, I don't condone smoking. I just, I have my habit. And I use very low nicotine content in it too, so that way I'm not like really bad. Hoping to weed it out. But these games, they have lots of controversial themes in them, like uh, I think it was the last one. We had a bit of a racist in the game. There's a lot of like edgy scenarios in these kind of games. They try to make them real, but at the same time they, they want to kind of push the boundaries. And I don't necessarily agree with some of the stuff, but um, they are they do push the boundaries in these games. And things that happen in this game I don't condone. Like the smoking and the racism and stuff like that. So just so you know, it is only a game, and I want to put that out there, it is only a game. It is not a viewpoint, it is not a belief, it is not a lifestyle, it is just a game. So it does show you some things like this the still continuing problem of like racism in in America in the world like when it's something that shouldn't be happening so I mean that's something like it's something that we could actually discuss when these things are going on like why they're showing this kind of stuff it's like that guy calling them a racial slur and being the way he was is just to show like it is still a continuing problem in this country and we're in the, we're in the 21st century there shouldn't be those kind of things anymore we shouldn't have these kind of issues yet we still do and old school thinking and the way people are who don't want to try and better themselves are still around. Hey, Daniel. How are you doing? It sucks. I'm coming. Mushroom wants to go out. Don't you hear? Yeah, sorry. Move. So, what's going on? It doesn't fit in. There's too much stuff. It's fucking bullshit. Okay, no more swearing. Sure. Like you're always polite. Come on. Chill out. What did you pack in? What the f Dude, you can't fit the whole room in. Don't worry. Your super strong big brother can help. <laughs> awesome. Thanks, Sean. Well... Looks like we're almost set. Where's Mushroom? Still peeing, I guess? Uh-oh. I'm gonna check what she's up to. <sighs> okay, I'll fill up our bottles and I'll catch up with you guys. Bad feeling. They're 
might be a bad scenario coming, just to uh, let you know. I don't like this. Okay, refill canteens. No poo? Really? Once you get used to squatting. Oh! Oh, no, no. No. This oh. is rank. I'm gonna poop in a bucket. <sighs> Sharing with Daniel was the worst. Did they have running water? They must have running water. For the shower. This room is fucking cold, so... We put yeah. everything we didn't need in it and keep it closed. Ah, okay. Okay, can you access anything there? I don't see anything here we can deal with. Bad, bad feeling about this. Uh, scotch bottle, but, um, okay, we don't need anything here. Magazine. Time to fit these canteens into my backpack. All right, so nothing if I can. important. Okay. Add canteens. Okay, all done. Where the hell is he? All right, what's going on? Hey, search. Daniel! Daniel! Hey, you out here? There's tracks. Daniel! There's multiple tracks. Where is he? What the heck is going on? Ooh, where we go? have a two day walk ahead of us. Better get going. Daniel is nowhere to be seen. Call him by holding left button and A. Daniel? Where are you? I have a feeling it's going to be this way. No, no tracks. What are they doing? Dude, what are you doing? Oh, crap. Oh, there was a trap right there. Eh, whatever. What the fuck happened here? Oh, gosh. Oh, what's going to happen? That's not good. Oh, this could be bad. This could be really bad. Oh, please don't make me cry. Daniel? Oh, crap. Oh, shit. Oh, God. No, no, Daniel. no, no. No. Not move. It killed her. She was my friend. Calm down, okay? Listen. Leave me alone. No. Oh, God. Um... God. <laughs> Why? Oh, fuck. Daniel. I'm so sorry. 
just wouldn't have changed anything to kill it. I'm right here. It's all right. That poor puppy. <laughs> no. <laughs> I told you these games have really dramatic turns of events. And oh man. God. It, they're life choices. They're things that have to happen. They're just really strong dramatic events that change the course of your story. That was fuck, oh, I knew something bad was gonna happen. Ah. Oh. Here. You should do it. But we taught him an important life lesson from it. That regardless of what's going on, it's you shouldn't you shouldn't use his power to kill people. To kill things. That's the whole point. Is like that is gonna change That's decisions it. for him in the future, hopefully. It's God. Can't even bury her. Well, Unless you want to say something. Uh, goodbye, Mushroom. You were such a good puppy. I'll always remember. Running through the snow with you. And how you... You snuggled. And... I'll never forget you. Never. Thank you, Mushroom, for looking after us in these woods. You won't be forgotten. Sean, do you think she's up in heaven? With Dad? <sighs> yeah. I'm sure he will look after her. About his allergies. Don't worry, Inanna. There's no allergies up there. They'll be fine together. Okay. We should go. It's getting late. Okay. Now we have even more reason to leave this place because of that. Oh, man. I tried to warn you guys. I knew something bad was going to happen. I just knew something bad was going to happen. Mm, God, that poor puppy. Wish we didn't have to go. I'd like having the house again. Come on. Let's hit the road. What about my traps? Should we leave them up? <laughs> They'll protect the next runaways that stay here. I put both you in charge of the house mushroom. <laughs> so long, my dudes. take a quick break I'm gonna get some more coffee and then we'll keep going so I will be oh, why is this not working hold on my mouse is not working for some weird reason uh, crying out loud pause that there we go Okay, I will be...
What if they went on vacation? Or, or something? We'll figure out something. I'm sorry, we don't want any of... Hello, Claire. Sean? Oh, my. Is that... Daniel? What's going on out here? I heard... Look who's here! After all this time. What the hell are you doing here? Stephen, watch your mouth. Well... <laughs> It's kind of a long story. <coughs> oh, you poor thing. You know he's sick, right? Yeah, but... Okay, inside. Both of you. Okay, at least we got a good reception, somewhat. I also love the art style of these games. I don't know, it's, it's that cell shit kind of almost, but I don't know how to, how to describe it. Hey, is it uh, warm enough for you? Oh yeah, feels nice and toasty. I gave Daniel some cough medicine. But you should have taken better care of him. He could have been worse. You were lucky. Stephen, may I talk to you for a second? They have to know. It's been all over the news. Did I make a mistake coming here? Maybe we should call Gus. Oh, shit. I'm so hungry, my belly hurts. I can't hear what they're saying. Really want to involve other people? No, maybe we can help. We have to do something. I don't know if you can hear what they're talking about. They're talking about it. Yeah, they're talking about this, figuring out what to do, and now they're going to talk to me about what happened. Just tested your work computer and it's fixed. Awesome! That's great. Are you all right, honey. You want more tea? Thanks. I'm glad it's working. I'm good. Uh, well, Sean, uh, do you want to talk about? Uh, uh... The police called us a few weeks ago. They're looking for you as suspects. In a homicide? And for assault and robbery in a gas station? Now, if you want us to help you, did you hurt that police officer in Seattle? Seriously? You really think I killed that cop? No, don't, don't get mad, Sean, we have to ask. We only know what we saw in the news. All I know is that he shot Dad. And now he's gone. Oh, sweetie. We are so sorry for what happened to your father, but why did you run away if you're innocent? Hmm, see, there's, there's the underlying... Thing right there I am too yesterday afternoon sucked yeah I'm sure it did 
yeah, I hope these guys are cool to him as well. Like, we're, at least they're discussing it with him instead of just instantly pointing a finger, you know? Um, there we go. Protect Daniel. I didn't want Daniel to see Dad. Like that. I felt like I had to protect him. I understand, but... You know the police would separate us. Maybe forever. Daniel would end up in foster care. Ah, you, you can't be sure, Sean. Anyway, at least you've managed to come here alive. We're glad you two are okay. Where's Daniel? Is he sleeping? I yeah, I think he's think upstairs what sleeping. What happened to both of you? You need to think of long-term solutions now. I tried. They, they I gave swear. him cough medicine, so I think maybe that probably knocked him out. But I can't sleeping. do everything. So, what are your plans? Ooh, do we tell them? Because they could rat us out. I feel like they're in with us, but I'm concerned that if we tell them what's gonna, what we're going to do, they're going to tell the cops. So far, they've been pretty cool. Do we trust them or don't we? Their family, I feel like we should trust them. See, these are the things like what would you what do other what would you do like would you trust them you're on the run from the cops they're questioning you about what's going on they're being sympathetic but like what what is the best solution here is there a good solution probably not let's go ahead and just tell them where we're going see what happens from there go down to mexico Puerto Lobos. Dad has a family house there. Sean. You can't run away from the law like, like fugitives. How can you look out for your brother if you're both running from the police? You two are gonna stay with us. Oh, Stephen. Maybe we should... After your mother left... Your dad never really wanted us in your life. I can't blame him. But you're still part of our family, and uh, we want to prove it. Okay? All right on, Grandpa! Whoa, really? Uh, uh, aren't you scared? The police already called you. Lordy, yes. But we were also scared for you. That's why you'll have to be careful around here. Beaver Creek is small and nosy. Yeah, small towns usually are. We can stay. Ah! This is awesome. <laughs> you oh, Sean, little rat. Guess what? There's a huge model train upstairs. Hey, you're supposed to be resting, young man. <laughs> yeah, yes he is. But he seems better already. Anyway, you and Daniel will stay here. At least until Daniel's better. We'll see what happens next. So, I bet you're hungry. I don't trust I her. Something. I like Grandpa. I don't trust Grandma. I don't know. I got a weird feeling about her. She's a little too hesitant on everything. How do you feel, Super Wolf? Way better. It's nice and warm in here. And the food? Yum. Yeah. Feels good. Feeling better? You look cozy. Yeah. I love that bed. 
Thanks, Grandma. Good. Your temperature is down. I'm way better now. You still need to take it easy. How about if we say a little prayer and, and give thanks? It's like a bedtime story, right? Well, this is a bit like this, yes. Except the story comes from up there. <laughs> the ceiling. So are we ready to pray? So apparently Just we weren't raised really religious, I'm guessing. But we're going to humor her so that we don't tick her off. Sure. We need all the help we can get. Can you ask the blessed dad? And Sean. Um, and Mushroom. And you and Grandpa. And, uh, everybody else. Oh my, you are so sweet. Thank you, Lord, for bringing Sean and Daniel safe and sound into our house. Take care of Esteban and, uh, Mushroom. Please, give us the strength to get over the hardships of the past and the trials yet to come. Amen. 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 Okay, it's bedtime. Try to get some rest. You still need it. And no roughhousing in here. No worries. We're too tired. Good night. Oh, and thanks again. Good night, Grandma. At least we're warm, fed, Feels and so nice to have a bed again. In a good bed. And a bathroom. I hear that. Plus, you don't smell anymore. Whatever. Well, Claire seems pretty caring. And nice. I guess Steven is too. I hope we'll be fine here. I think so. And the more important thing is you'll have time to get better. Sean? Are we in Mom's old room? Nah, I don't think this is the one. Not from what I remember. But it's been a while. Could we check it out tomorrow? Maybe find some of her stuff? Hmm, let's find Why out why. Why would like. you want to do that? I just don't know anything about her. Daniel. I understand, but we need to focus on where we are now and where we're off to. Mom left us. She made her choice. We gotta make ours, and we can't keep going back. You know what I mean? Yeah. Uh, I guess. Hey, man. You've been doing so great with your, well, you know. I was wondering, how do you do it? Uh, I don't know. I concentrate and it just happens. Hmm, that's a good question. Does it hurt? Wait, does it hurt? It's kind of itchy, though. And exhausting. <laughs> Sorry. Anyway. Remember the rules, right? We really don't want Claire or Stephen to start asking questions. I know, I know. Don't show, don't talk. Just keep that in mind and everything should be fine. Sleep tight. Now, like any good story. Little cup. Like, just like in the movies, these things are really good about, like, being close. You know we're going to do something stupid, and something's going to change our situation. So he's going to get angry about something, and boom, power is just going to explode, because he can't control it when he's angry.
Beaver Creek, Oregon, one week later. Oh, we've been here a week already. Nice. So it looks like we're doing pretty good. We're well rested. We're being fed. <clears throat> Looks like things are going pretty good, so you know things are going to change pretty quick. Ooh, I remember those old space heaters. Oh, man. I could sleep all day long in this bed. Oh, but I'm way too... That's cool Claire dug this up for us. Oh. Dad's such a baller in his suit. Their wedding photo. This is pretty good so far. In I know that Steven mind. only has crime and train books. Oh, okay, let's get dressed. Because we don't need to keep walking around in our frog boxers. All right. I'm allowed to go out now. Dice, earmuffs, you don't really need to look at any of this stuff. Wooden blocks, Daniel's bag. Let's take a quick look at Daniel's bag. There's water spilled on the floor, dude. You had a camera? When did you get a camera? And that is the creepiest doll I've ever seen. Let's see, we've got canteens, we've got nine bucks, night in the forest. Okay, we've got some extra stuff, which is good. Uh, we haven't, he, I love the fact that he's a, like a really good artist. We haven't, um, oh, this is really cool. An elephant in the room. <laughs> oh, so we haven't really taken a drawing of anything for our souvenirs i feel like that tree in the first one was where we were before so i think we missed something somehow um the train has obviously got to be here because there's a train in the house there's like a little model train in the house okay so let's leave Shut there up. we go finally Breakfast almost done, so come down when you're ready, okay? Okay. Choo choo. Oh, so careful, Chief. They're going too fast. We have to. Uh. Late. <sighs> What's up? Ah, look who's here. But uh, you're too late for the 915 Express. Um, it's okay. I'll take the next one. It will leave after breakfast. Don't be late this time. <laughs> I won't. I'm glad they get along so good. What do we do to get... Daniel's definitely the ideal grandson. That's what I want to ask. What do we do to get the train? <sighs> it's been locked ever since we got that here. That must be Mom's room. I kind of don't give a fuck. Medicine, towels, do we... Okay, let's wash our face. Oh, man. How did we survive for weeks out there with no hot water? Do we... Can we shower? Can not shower. Okay. <clears throat> let's go downstairs for breakfast. Because I have a feeling... No, we're not doing that. Should we do that? I hit the kitchen quick. Ooh, wait a minute. <sighs> Better not sneak in. They won't like it. Although I have a feeling there's going to be a reason for that. Oh, look at this house. This is awesome. I want a house like this. Okay. Kitchen. I was just playing games. I don't remember much from the last time I came here. Oh my, look who's awake. 
Eh. Good morning, sleepyhead. It's that bed. Feels like a cloud. <laughs> I know. Daniel, mm. breakfast time. Your brother is ready. <sighs> Grandpa showed me a bob star. Steven. Your grandson needs to eat now. You can <laughs> show him the boxcar later. I love how they're getting along. Uh, yeah, let's see. Need Do you help. need help or anything? Oh, don't worry. I can do this in the dark. <laughs> but thanks for the offer. All right, all right. <laughs> Are you boys done playing? We had a express delivery with the passengers, but the engine broke down. Yep, has to go straight to the workshop. Good. No trains in the kitchen, remember? Gotcha, Chief. Choo-choo! <laughs> oh, oh, sugar. He Don't can do fix it. His trains, but not Don't do it, Daniel. Kitchen. Did I make enough? Everything's okay? It's great. As usual. You're the best cook ever. Looks like you're getting cozy with this new country life after all. Mmm. Yeah, let's better her yeah. up. Yeah. It's nice to be far away from everything. Feels like we're the only ones out here. Well, that's exactly why we love it. It feels safe. Unlike the big city. I get it. I like it. It's cool here. Well, bless your soul. <laughs> You'd get along good with our neighbors. We try to lend a hand. Like to Charles next door. He lost his wife, and things have been hard on him and his son. He would just get lost in Seattle. But we're all taking care of him here. How old is his son? I, I think he's your age. Ooh, cool. Though obviously we're gonna have an interaction with the son. I have a feeling we're going to be meeting the neighbors soon. Stop it, you crazy? Hey, what's going on back there? Nothing. Oh, <laughs> I thought Stephen was a fast eater. Hey, Grandma, I wanted to ask you something about that locked room upstairs. I told you there is nothing to see in it, Daniel. Why were you in it this morning, then? Because there's a lot of old junk in there. And besides, it's not safe for you to explore, okay? But we'll be fine. Don't push it, Daniel. Why don't you go explore outside? You sure look like you're getting better. Get some fresh air. I'll wait for Sean, and then we'll go. We won't be loud. Promise. But be careful nobody sees you. Stay in the back, okay? He's gonna try and force the door open, isn't he? Maybe you should tell him that it was Karen's room. It's just a room now, Sean. Nothing to see. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah. There Why is. lock it then? It feels like you're hiding something. There's no secret. We just want to move on with our lives, Sean. Something happened. So nobody goes in the room, okay? I'm serious. Did mom ever contact you? She only talked to dad a few times. 
Then she was gone. <sighs> yes, she was. You know, Sean, I don't really want to talk about this anymore. It's over. Anyway, you have to respect my rules under my roof, okay? Yeah, we're going to... Of course. Always. I appreciate that, Sean. Now you better go find your brother. There's a shed with some old toys outside. I'll bet Stephen has the key. Danny will freak. Thank you. She is definitely hot. Ooh, excuse me, hiding something. Easel, travel picture. Don't really care about any of this stuff. Christmas decorations. Recipes. I better catch up with Steven and get those keys. Okay. Daniel's going nuts in here. Five by Ooh. four? Thirty six? Standard storage pantry. Uh, hold on. Hey, Mr. Pout. What's going on? Why do I have to do homework when I'm not even in school? Uh, I know it sucks, but you still have to learn things, or you'll become dumb. Okay, but these problems are stupid. I know, man. I've been there too. Just do your best. Tidy up. Let's let's be good kids. See you tonight, buddy. Is it? Shoot, I don't know. I'm done. Are you? Don't feel like you worked on that long enough. Let's see if we can find. Hmm. There he is. I think I need a handy assistant. Can you hand me the glue in the cupboard behind me? Sure. Hold. Whoa! Careful. Sorry, I I forgot. That thing isn't too stable. Let me just. He's oh, holding okay. it up with blocks. Uh, sorry, my fault. Your grandmother keeps telling me, but uh, I'm a lazy old man. <laughs> hey, uh, can you close the door? I want to talk for a second. Oh. Looks like he was a fireman because he's wearing a fire uh, shirt and there's the an axe on the wall. Of course, yeah, that happens all the time. So that typically is usually like a retirement thing, like when you, like they give you like the small axe so, or a plaque. Listen, I've uh, noticed things with Daniel. You know what I'm talking about, don't you? Oh, moral choice. <sighs> Yeah, no, we're gonna hide it. Um, not really. What things? Well, I, I'm not sure how to put it. Like, some kind of invisible force, like a holy gift or something. Um, yeah. Daniel likes to pretend he's got superpowers, but that's it. That's it? Okay, but be careful, Sean. You know, he's still so young. Sure. And by the way, let's keep this between us. Claire has a lot of strong beliefs. She wouldn't understand. Oh, Grandpa she is cool. Daniel and just wants both of you to be safe and happy. What I'm trying to say is, maybe you should stay here with us. I know you boys plan to run to Mexico, but... Hmm.
Yeah, why not? Thanks. Maybe we could, but... <sighs> why not? I know, being out here in the sticks with us old farts isn't exciting, but... This is your home now. <laughs> it's cool. Kinda different, but... <sighs> I just don't want you to get into trouble because of us. It's dangerous to be on the road. Do you think your father would have wanted this for his kids? Of course not. Oh, but everything's uh, different now. I know. Oh. I know. Oh, I well, got to shut that off. About it. Sorry about the boop. But don't torture yourself. I will. Hey, uh, Claire said you had the keys for the tool shed? Oh, uh, sure. <clears throat> Here. You guys enjoy the sun. And be careful with that shed. It's probably a mess inside. Thanks. I like Grandpa. Well, real quick, let me. It's good to see you in my lair. <laughs> you know, you... Just let me shut this off. Because uh, I forgot to do it. Mm -hmm. You know, I don't have much time left on this, but. Uh... We're afraid to come in here as a kid. Really? Uh, why? No idea. Uh, but. You're a big boy now. You can take a look around. I won't eat you. Cool. Eh. Train catalog. <laughs> Picture. I must be mom. Oh. Uh, oh, I triggered I something. This. I, uh, I just forgot to, uh, it's okay. It's been a while since I've seen her face. Uh, yeah. I like taking a look at it from time to time. I'm digging Same. Grandpa. Grandpa is cool. Her... Yeah, it does. But she's still my daughter, you know. I can't approve what she's done, but I, I, I think I understand. Good. I don't. I think mom oh, had the same power. I'm sorry, John. Please don't. Uh, please don't say anything to Claire about this, okay? Don't worry. I won't. I really think mom had the same power. Ooh. Disco ball. Oh, I want to know about this. <laughs> How come you have a disco ball? Are you like throwing parties and stuff? <laughs> no, this is a, a souvenir. You know, I, I actually met your grandma during a disco night. Believe it or not. For real? <laughs> That's so cool. She was such a good dancer. We danced the hustle. <laughs> and I, I knew I was going to marry that woman. Aww. By the way, I have no idea what you're talking about, but it sounds so very cute. <laughs> well, I'd show what it is if only these hips allowed me to. Dude, that's so. I know what he's talking about. I'm sorry, Sean. I know you guys miss your games and your websites. But trust me, a, a break from all this can only do you good. You know, and it's, it's safer that way. Yeah, yeah. I know. So yeah, we definitely know. We know. Jarring. Oh. Ooh. Man. Who did this? Oh, he was our neighbor's son, Chris. Yeah, I, I helped him and his dad build that treehouse. Why are you holding a fire sword? <laughs> I'm, I'm not sure. You know, that kid sure has an imagination. <laughs> that kid must be from the other game that I was talking about at the beginning um, about the kid who mm, yeah, can bring comic books like I've got to find that game 
Wow. Is that you? Mm, yeah, that was taken when I retired. The mayor came to congratulate me himself. That's awesome. Yeah, really great day. Ah, I wish you'd been here. Yeah, 40 years of service, it says on the black there. Oh, there you are, Sean. Got the key? Hey, I have to go out and run some errands. Can you do me a big favor? Do you know how to work a washing machine? Since I was about eight. Of course. Can you throw in yours and your brother's clothes after the next load? They're in the bathroom basket. Totally, yeah. Um, no problem. Thank you so much. <laughs> Feel free to start tidying your stuff, too. Yeah. It's good for the health to keep a house clean. Definitely. Daniel can help. Ah, and remember, for your own safety, no phone and no internet. I know, I know, boring rules. Don't worry, Claire. Hey, Daniel! There's work for you. Uh, no. I'm busy. B busy my ass! Come over here. <laughs> you gotta find me first. Oh, I just saw that door. I saw it move. Oh. oh, he's using his powers to do stuff. Oh, the bandana. I cannot relive that. And she feels off. Yeah, she does feel a little off. She's not too bad, though. I get that he's sick of all this shit, but why are we playing this game? The bad feeling about this. Oh, yes. So now, see, he's doing that to mess with us. I know he's not here. I know you're in there. Gotcha. What the? Behind you. Yeah, very funny. No more hiding. Seriously. Okay, okay. What do I have to do? You tidy the mess in our room, and I take care of the laundry. Cool? Again? We always have to clean everything. I don't wanna. Yeah, I hear you. Never mind, okay? Cool. Thanks, Sean. Alright, so... Laundry, pick up. All right, let's get it over with. Grandpa's cool. She's, yeah, she's a little off. I'm not sure exactly what's up with that. Where's the laundry room, by the way? Um, though she's been pretty cool about everything. All right, time to take care of that laundry. Toilet. <sighs> Thanks, Claire. Uh, no. Aquarium. Where? Travel picture. Where's the laundry at? Sean, quick. Look at this fish. It's so beautiful. Dude, come on. What? Look, I told you there's a fish in it. I haven't seen any actual fish in there since we got here. <laughs> it was an invisible fish. Uh, okay, laundry, 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 laundry. Uh, that's probably it. Oh, good lord! Switch on. Feels so good to be safe at last. There it is. Okay, washing machine. Oh, note. Look at the note. As always with Claire. I can't really tell if this is cute or bossy. Dear husband, if you do laundry, please follow these simple rules. Do not mix whites and colors, ever. Use one cup of detergent, red box, for each load. If you wash my clothes, use the delicate cycle so you don't ruin any more of my clothes. <laughs> Love wife. How many programs does this thing have? Okay. It will do. All right, so we did the laundry. I think now we go upstairs. I 
the pantry? Yeah, that was the pantry. Let's go clean the room. Do, do. Boring laundry. Done. Time for fresh air. Fresh air? We need to clean. Clean! We must clean the room! Alright. Yeah, fine. Alright, fine. Do, do. I'm still waiting for Daniel to, like, bust that room open. Shit. Why Seriously, are you man. doing that? Chicken. Don't be using your powers in here, you... Oy. Ooh, wait a minute. Discuss the decorations. Whoa. Look at all these decorations. That's so cool. That was it. That was it? That's all we talked... Okay, fine. Daniel, you ready? We can go out now. Yes. Wait for me. Well, I like the fact that we give, we're giving him some kind of a sem semblance of a normal life right now, especially oh, after everything that happened. Man, finally. It feels so good to be outside. Reminds me of the cabin. Right? Oh. <laughs> oh! 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 <laughs> Watch out for the pack. <laughs> Take a look at the shed. Let's open that up. Get ready for storage wars. <gasps> What's wrong? <sighs> Frozen shut. Of course. Uh oh. Sean. Look. Yeah, I think that's the kid from the other. Oh no. No, 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 no. I mean, he did the right he did a good thing, but no. Yeah, that's the kid from the other game. Who I think he has a the ability to, like control comics or something. Uh, see what? Yeah. Um, see what? We just got here. Are you okay? Uh, yeah. Uh, I didn't see anything either. Oh, uh, oh, oh. Okay, I just fell down into the snow. Dad says I'm kind of clumsy. That t-shirt is wicked. Who's your favorite superhero? I love Power, Power Bear. Bear. <laughs> oh man! I have the Mega Power Bear. You should check it out. Dude, that's so cool. Chris, oh god. Look, I, I am so sorry. Are you okay? Uh, Dad, I'm fine. I promise. Are, are you sure? Listen, I shouldn't. Do you know them? It it's okay, Dad. They're cool. He loves superheroes, even Power Bear. Ah, gotcha. Hey there. Are you staying with the Reynolds? Uh, okay, the what? He's got a kid with a secret. I don't, I've never played the other game, but he's got a kid with a secret. I think he knows the secret. So we're going to take a chance and say our grandparents. Oh, uh. Yeah. There are grandparents. Uh, I see. Oh, jeez, Chris. You don't have any damn shoes on. I'm sorry, buddy. Let's get you inside. I... Uh, yeah. Okay, Dad. <laughs> Thanks, guys. Oh, and, uh... If Claire asks... Guess who I just cut down? Tell her everything is... Who'd you cut down? Fine. What are you playing, Neil? He has a little, yeah, he's keep very cute. He has a little cape. I'm gonna have to check that game out and see. Maybe we'll play that game on here as well. Uh, what did he ask me? 
I missed that. Oh crap, I missed something. What did he ask? I don't know what to choose. Monkey Boy and Neo? Noise. Uh Sure? Sure. Uh no problem. Cool. See you around then. What do you ask us to do? Thanks, guys. See you later. Yes, we will. <sighs> Daniel. Did you forget everything about the rules already? Sorry, Sean. Did you want me to let him fall? Really? I can't rewind live on Twitch or I would help you. Yeah, it's okay. Don't worry about it. Uh, okay. Do we remind him of the rules or do we concede on this one? I mean, he did a good thing. I feel like disciplining him too much is going to be a problem, so I'm going to concede on this one. He did a good thing. No, you... You did the right thing. But listen, we can't let anybody know. We have to keep a low profile out here. He's like my age. I bet you would have done the same exact thing. Don't be mad. I'm not mad, dude. It's... It's over. Daniel, remember that we're hiding out. So no training and no showing off your power. From now on, you stick with me all the time, okay? <laughs> yeah, I forgot all about that game before this. So that, it's kind of cool that they, they're they bringing all like the things together. So like Arcadia Bay was from the first game, and we passed that. And then the next, oh, Beaver Cake the next morning. Um, and now this kid in Beaver Creek, Oregon, if I knew that that's where that took place, I would have been like, whoa, you know, I am at the neighbor. Oh, fuck. That kid never listens. Oh. So I'm kind of curious about this, you know, his game now. He had an interesting ability. I, I, I don't know much about it, for but I'm I'm very very curious. I think I might want to play that game and see what it's like. Maybe we'll do it on the stream as well, and then uh, we get a little more information about about that little kid and his powers. Um, but we're about two hours. I think this is a good stopping point. It seems like this works out really good after we just met that little kid with the cape and everything. So we're going to save it here. We're going to do this again next Thursday morning. I hope you all had fun watching, and I hope you enjoyed this. And again, if you're new, please make sure you follow. Um, trying to get our way to 50 so we can get our affiliate. So don't be shy. If you stop in and watch, make sure you talk. Um, but yeah, we're going to end it there. Uh, I'm going to go enjoy the rest of my day. And who knows, maybe we'll play something a little bit later tonight. Um, so with that, this is going to be Lakota Ravik signing off. Y'all be good Mandalorians. Oh, I guess I got to pause it. <laughs> I should get